Alison Fisher. I'm a professional pool player by day and can you believe it, a shuffleboard player in the evenings. And I'm here today to show you some basics. To start the game of shuffleboard, you can do rock, paper, scissors, which I'm no good at, or you can call tails and spin to win. Yep, I won. As we know, I won the coin toss and I'm going to elect to go second. In a game of shuffleboard that's also known as the hammer and is an advantage. So let's get to it. I'm going to play Harry now and he's going to go first. Let's look at the score after that round. A round is when all of eight pucks are shot, or weights as they're known too. Um, so looking at the points here, Harry unfortunately for me is blue. So you see this puck here that goes off the edge? That gets an extra point, that's also known as a hanger. So he's in the three point zone, he gets an extra point, so he gets four points for the hanger. This one hasn't quite crossed the line, even though it's 99.9% .9 over the line in the three zone, it actually becomes a two, which is very fortunate for me and unlucky for Harry. Unlucky Harry. This one is a two, and then that's the only score he gets because then it goes to my puck, which is red. So anything beyond my puck, he scores all these points. So he's got four, five, six, seven, eight, now he's uh, really half the game already because this one's a race to 15, so we'll see what happens in the next round. At the end of round two, we can see, looking at the board, that Harry has a puck that is right behind the foul line. During the game, as if this happens, it gets removed from the table, okay? And as we move down, we can see that only my pucks are left on the table and I've scored one, two, three points because even though this puck is straddling the two point line, it's not fully over so that becomes a one pointer. So I have gained three points on Harry in this round. Okay Harry, looks like I gained on you there a little bit. So that's two points to me. So that would make it five to eight. I'm right on your tail now. There are other games that you can play on your shuffleboard table, such as knock off, crazy eight, horse collar, target, tap and draw, and baseball. Have fun with all of these games and go to playcraft.com for more information.